We're out here at the uh, Otter Creek campground. Uh, we're like, just trying to pick some spots. A little more luxurious than what I'm used to. I mean, hey, it was like a water spigot. I don't have to filter it. I don't have to dig a hole when I have to go to the bathroom. It's pretty out here though. Not bad. I think we're gonna have like a real nice, luxurious night out. Yeah, I'm on my butt here. Use my setup, my Superfly, and uh, my old Skeeter beater. How's it feeling there, buddy? This is amazing. Yeah. Y'all going with that, man? I don't think I can. I think I'm gonna survive. Here's Hillbilly Guru setting up. Are you making a slingshot? <laughs> I got to slap the other end or something. <laughs> yes, sir. I had uh, my mylar over there. Have your wool blanket inside, and then you zip up the uh, sleeping bag. You guys that make schematics for a hillbilly uh, wetsuit. I never thought I'd actually see one in the wild in my life, man. But uh, we've got a hammock panda. I'll give you a heads up of the system I'm going with. Got my uh, Amit Gear Cuban Fiber Tarp. Uh, got my uh, DIY Hammock. Hammock Gear 20 degree top quilt with two ounces of overstuff. Yeah, it's kind of dark. And then got my under quilt 20 degree with under stuff or over stuff, two ounces. And I got the uh, under quilt protector from 2QZQ I'll be trying out. I've had it hanging on my uh, hammock back in my room. I got it on a hammock stand and it's been doing pretty cool. And I'm definitely gonna be testing that wind factor tonight. Lows are supposed to get down into the 20s, so we'll see how cold we can roll. Hillbilly Guru system here. Something he's dubbed the uh, flying space sausage. Gotta get the full effect. Yeah. With a survival potato. <laughs> With a survival potato. Rock off. We'll see how that works out. Dance, Panda! Dance! what he's using okay I got camp foam I got army wool I got the sleeping bag I got a little fleece just rub against my face I like that oh, and then yes. another layer of uh, mylar and then like the mylar over and then of course I got a piece of uranium just to like heat me long term Where's the bag at? where'd you get your uranium Lowe's <laughs> talk about backpacker gone civilized Bathrooms. My little friend out here. Got a couple of other ones going on here.
I got you foggy. Excellent. It's about time to get me some cocoa and some uh, loaded baked taters. We got some uh, flurries out here. I'm about to do my dinner. Got some uh, cocoa going on in there. And my own little concoction in here. It's uh, instant loaded baked potatoes, some dehydrated vegetable flakes, some parsley, uh, a little bit of pepper, some salt. And I got some uh, chicken in there too. Mmm, slop. Okay, James, you think you can flip over that grate? Yeah, we got some cool bosses right on the grate. My slop is turning out to be fantastic. And I got my cocoa. Chili. Hmm? A bit chili. Starting to get chili. I got my little hanging thermometer thing over there. We'll see how low it gets tonight. Oh, hard to see, but they're over there messing with the fire. I made the mistake of uh, hitting the hammock. I don't want to move. I'm stuck. And warm and toasty. I'll be sleeping with my water bottle between my legs tonight, so I'll make sure my water doesn't freeze over. I don't think it'll be cold enough. I'll just wrap my uh, other bottle up in one of my wool socks I'm wearing. I'm going to switch out to my uh, possum down socks, which are going to be awesome. So we had some flurries, it's wet, it's muddy, it's going to get down to the 20s. Okay, it is totally bedtime. I will uh, report back to you guys in the morning. Good morning. Made it through the night. I'm about to go get me my coffee and get some oatmeal going. Let's see how low it got. I don't think it got too cold. I slept like a baby. Uh, very good sleep. Just kicking back here. Listen to the birds. Real nice, quiet, calm morning. Just downright relaxing out here, man. I think I might go in to get my coffee and oatmeal going before they get up. Just have a nice, quiet breakfast for myself. Ah, coffee's on. Now it's a little bit warmer than it was last time we were away. Hopefully about 25 or 26 maybe. Let's see. Got down to 26.6 degrees. Oh, well, yeah. Hibbly Guler has arrived. These possum down socks were awesome. I think any lower than 20, I'd want to like step up the game to like down booty level or something though. I did just fine though. I was like warm and toasty all night. I crashed out for probably close to 12 hours. 
That sounded like a rock. It was good. I got my dishes done. And my coffee finished. Uh, the, I love this tarp, man. You can see the trees through it. Another beautiful piece from Hammock Gear. I got my Black Rock Down hat rocking. I didn't need it last night. I didn't need it till the morning. It's just like cold, high humid, or high humidity. It's a cold morning. Got warm and toasty down there though. These quilts are awesome. Thank you, Storm Crow. So I noticed uh, around mile, well, I don't know, six or seven or so, back when I was hiking, that uh, my toes would start rubbing together. So I went and uh, perused through some forums and did some research, and eventually I made the decision that I was going to be that guy. So I switched to using these, my little toe sock things. And, well, on the uh, as I found out a couple of days ago, yeah, they did the trick, man. They're awesome. Oh no, I'm that guy. <laughs> At least I still have my dignity, right? Right? <laughs> Whatever you say there, Sparkle Motion. <gasps> Camp burglars. All right, we're breaking up camp. Had a nice chilly, frosty night, but we uh, survived. We're gonna load up and get out of here. Thank you guys for coming along.